Hey Plenty friends, welcome back to another new video or hi if you are new. My name is David and today I'm going to be giving us a 6 months propagation update on my string of hearts that I have propagated a lot of times by the butterfly method. So this was not even expected, today was supposed to be a video about my favorite houseplants of April but that video is not ready yet so I'm gonna post this one today. But even then I feel like it's going to be like really interesting because it's going to be a 6 months update on this propagation update. No, I will have the playlist linked down below and also one of the ads will be, will be popping up in the corner so you guys can go and check it out if you guys want to after this video on how I have propagated them, how I propagate string of hearts, and how I do the butterfly method with the string of hearts. So without further ado, let me go and show you guys the string of hearts. These past days have been raining like crazy and it's just been such a cloudy day. I don't know, it's it kind of like messes up with my mood. <laughs> it's always cloudy and I want it to be like sunny, but it is the raining season. Okay, so now we're in the plant room. I do have the window open to like get some fresh air as well as some humidity. It is 87% humidity and 71 Fahrenheit. So it's pretty good, but where are they? So let me show you the mother plant. This is the mother plant that I have bought from plantsarena.com, which I have done a unboxing a while back. And I have propagated this girl late so much. And honestly, those strings have grown like crazy since I ended up watering it and fertilizing it. I only water this girl like once a month, even though I should be watering it more, but that's just the way I do it because I'm scared of giving it root rot. And y'all, I literally just noticed that it grew like three inches within like three days. Um, So that's beyond me right now, but yeah, so let me go turn on the light because it's a little bit dark in here and depressing. So here are the string of hearts. And before I even tell you guys about this one, it, it ended up collapsing when we moved to the apartment. Um, So a lot of the strings ended up snapping. But even then, it has grown like crazy. Like, look at all this. And it is also starting to bloom, which is super funny. Look at all those flowers. And there is more strings over here. And here and on the back over here as well so I might because I want it to be a little bit more bushy uh, but I'm not so sure if I'm gonna put a little bit more propagations on top or I'm just gonna let it do its thing I'm still gonna find out but yeah this is how it's doing you guys like it's just it looks so good it is on my grow lights so it does get 10 plus hours of artificial lighting I do fertilize it a lot and I do water this one more than I water the mother plants which is up in the ceiling but yeah and it's just it's crazy how like this was off from all little small cuttings by the butterfly method so we love propagating plants hello plenty friends so just to give you guys a little update this is not even planned but I was like posting some stuff on my stories like I am propagating some plants my bonnie spider plants and I ended up fixing my coniferous plants I was gonna toss that one out but then I realized the other one is doing super super good and the difference is that one has a little bit of sphagnum moss on top so I ended up placing some sphagnum moss on this one as well as this one and I'm gonna place it back in the grill lights my favorite grill lights and hoping for the best this one looks a lot better they both look super super bad this one needed a little bit of water but uh yeah as you guys can see it looks a little bit dry and then this one was well watered so as you guys can see it is putting out new leaves it looks super shiny and very happy but it's struggling to develop pictures and that's what's getting to me because i really want these to be like my pest control like thingies like they really really do help with fungus gnats and other pests yeah so if they just don't do good and i'm gonna toss it out ignore the spray we were playing um games in the plant room last night with my brothers and my boyfriend but uh, yeah so i ended up propagating some string of hearts as you guys can see i don't know why i already have this one over here which i'm gonna take some pictures for instagram possibly and then i already have my mother plants at the very top and i just i might sell these or i might just get give them away but i just like propagating plants i think it's super super fun i ended up like i said on my stories showing them a lot of propagation updates to them because some people do not follow me on youtube over here and i want to show them as well what's going on in the plants room so yeah, I, there's a lot of stuff with roots developing. I also have some roots and some Arizonias that are honestly ready to be rooted and it's raining again. Y'all, this is a, the third day that it's been raining nonstop, which I know I'm not complaining. It's really, really beautiful and I love it, but I want a little bit of sun. <laughs> I want a little bit of my plants to get a little bit of light. But even then, it's amazing because a lot of the plants outside, they're just loving it right now. They're enjoying life. This leaf is really catching my attention right now. Like, I think it's so beautiful. Like, look at this, you guys. This is a new leaf. 
Uh, the real. It's one of the ones that I want so bad. But I, I'm pretty sure they're gonna like produce at Costa Farm or Plants Arena. They're gonna sell it pretty soon. I will be giving you guys an update on these cuttings. Uh, I was trying to pull them out to look at the roots because I don't see nothing going on over here. But I was kind of struggling. So I think there's some roots developing. And over here as well. But yeah, you guys. So I just want to show you guys what I'm propagating. Um, some string of parts. Add some content in this video. Since it did end up being really, really short. Alrighty, guys. So this video was pretty short. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up to let me know. And like I said, I would have all these videos combined. From like updates to propagation. To like how I propagate the string of hearts. And a lot of other stuff. So I'll make sure to link down the playlist down below. And um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!